So, hey everyone, it's Lisa again, and I just wanted to share with you how you can train your pet on how to drink liquid acea. Uh, most of the time, when you when you introduce the liquid acea to your pets, there it has it does have a strong smell. So they may go over, investigate it. They might stick their tongue in, and then might not even drink it, but something you can do to get them to explore it so that they're more likely to drink it is that you can use a treat um, or some edible um, in order to get them to, to train them in, in accepting it. So just as a heads up, we definitely tell everybody that you want to drink or the goal is for your pet to drink the liquid acea straight without anything at all, because we know that food denatures the molecules. However, when you're training them, uh, I highly recommend that you do this. And eventually what happens with the pet is that they realize what these molecules, incredible molecules do for them, how they make them feel, and they will willingly come and drink the liquid and even let you know when they want it. So what you're going to do is you are going to have a designated ASEA bowl, okay? So that this way your pet can communicate to you when they want ASEA, which is a great thing. You want to have it in a designated place. And in order to train them, well, first of all, I just want to make sure that you know that you should have a separate ASEA bowl so you don't use it for anything else. And it should be glass not metal at all because that denatures the molecules. So what you'll do to train your animal is take, think about a treat that they might like and you are only going to use this as you train them on how to take a SIA. So this treat is going to be simply for a SIA and not for anything else. So what you can do is um, in the bowl, you will put the treat. So I have a little greenie here. So you would put the treat and you can put just a couple of drops of the ASEA. And when you put the bowl down, you're going to say ASEA. And the animal will go over, sniff it and, and probably eat it. And you're going to reinforce them. That's great, taking your ASEA and give them a little pat on the head, whatever you wanna do. And eventually what you're going to do is you are going to continue to do that a couple of times a day, um, at least do it a couple of times a day and you're going to decrease the amount of the treat and increase the amount of the ASEA until your pet eventually makes the connection and they do it very quickly and understands that the ASEA is good for them. So something, a really quick trick that I will share with you is that Parmesan cheese works really well because it's quite strong. So for, for dogs, you can use Parmesan cheese. And what you can do is just um, sprinkle a teeny amount of Parmesan cheese into a couple of drops of the ASEA and they'll pretty much lap it up. Um, I wouldn't do the Parmesan cheese for kitties, but um, just again, remember to use the, that treat is just designated for ASEA. So I hope that that is helpful and decrease the amount of the treats, increase the amount of the ASEA until they're drinking it straight. And if they never get to the point that they're drinking it straight, they are still getting benefits. So be sure to drop some comments and let me know if this video was helpful and feel free to reach out to me via my cell or in the calendar link. Thanks so much and have an awesome day, everyone.